high fans of high quality entertainment. I wasn't lip syncing. Hi fans of high quality entertainment and happy new year. Here is my question to you if you're a Beatles fan and there's probably two or three of you out there that are Beatles fans. What do you consider the very best Beatles solo album? Now this is including for instance Paul McCartney and Wings or uh, Plastic Ono Band or Elephant's Memory, whoever the, the separate Beatles were recording albums with, of course. And I've really, really had to think this one over. For instance, Ringo Starr, his uh, third album, simply called The Ringo, was damn good. And George Harrison, I think a lot of people are going to say, all Things Must Pass as their favorite Beatles solo album. And as good as that album is, I love 33 and the Third even more. Now for John Lennon, for me, it's his earlier albums, and I think Plastic Ono Band, you know, his first, his debut album after the experimental albums with Yoko, is probably his finest, but it's definitely not my favorite. Beatles solo album. And there's only one left, and that is Paul McCartney. And this has been a real struggle for me because, uh, for instance, I always say Chaos and Creation in the Backyard is my favorite Paul McCartney album. But I, when I really think about it, I might want to listen to that the most out of all of his albums, but that doesn't mean it's the very best. But it's right up there. There's also London Town, there's Band on the Run, uh, there's Flaming Pie, quite a few of them. But I'm going to have to go with Paul and Linda McCartney's Ram. Yep, it's just... Uh, it's kind of Beatlesque in a way, and what I also love about it is when it was released, it had a lot of bad reviews, quite a few bad reviews. And I, I don't even know if uh, all of the Paul McCartney fans liked it. I'm sure maybe they liked it, but they didn't maybe love it. Uh, but it's really grown in stature over the years, especially with, with the critics. And so I'm going to have to choose Ram. So I would love your thoughts in the comment section below on what you consider the best Beatles solo album. And please remember to thumbs up the video. I would really appreciate it. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.